Hello everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome back to another reaction video! This time it's the Pokemon Direct from... the 5th of June, 2019. I have not seen any of this. I mean, I know that we're getting Dynamax Pokemon, but that's about it. I know nothing about Pokemon Sword and Shield, and this is what it's covering. So, hope you're ready for about 20 minutes of this shit. Let's go! Not shit. Hope you're ready for about 20 minutes of uh, Pokemon and nothing else. Let's go! Oh yeah! Music! Welcome to Pokemon Direct. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. Hello, Ishihara. Ishihara-san. I would like to provide the latest news about the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games. Alright, you do that. To begin, please take a look at this video. Already watching this video. Final. This definitely looks like it could be Scotland. Probably not. Yeah, probably Scotland. I don't know. Or Holland. I want the bunny. And I'm playing as the girl. Hello. Ooh, female professor? Right. Or is that just an old woman? Pretty sure that's the professor though, because they have been spoiled a little bit with fan art. Oh my god, this looks great. Oh my god, this actually looks really good. Where do I throw my money? And when is this coming out, too? Hopefully November, because I've spent a lot of money this month already. Or in the last two months. I don't want to spend much more. Oh my god! Oh my god, it looks so good! Wait. Is this one of the stories... Hello, Dynamax Pokémon. But is this one of those stories where, uh... One character... Whatever character you pick, your rival is the opposite? So, like, I could pick the female, and then the male would have a slightly different story, or just the same path and all that, but, like, that's it. I just make a Dynamax Pokemon? Is that what we're gonna do? Oh my god, we are. We're doing it. Oh my god, are we catching one? We are catching a Dynamax Pokemon. Nice! Soccer? Football, rather. Well, I know, is this just how the battles go? This is just how the battles go, okay. International football. I love it. Oh, it's a Dynamax battlefield. Okay! Nice. I was gonna ask, like, how does that work? Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh my god, I'm hyped. Hello, Game Freak. Look at you guys hard Hello, at work. I'm Masuda from Game Freak. Hello, Masuda. Hi, I'm Omori from Game Freak. Hi, Omori. You sound a little what like do Gabe you Newell. Think of the video? Your English dub guy sounds like Gabe Newell. Today, we would like to deliver the latest news on Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield to all of you around the world, right here from Game Freak's offices where development is underway. All right. Cool. You can take on the role of the main character, who resides in the Galar region. After choosing Gallery Ruby, region. Scorbunny, okay. or Sobble as your first Scorbunny. Pokemon, you will embark on an adventure Not to, to make Sobble cry more, but like your journey Score will Bunny. take you through vast and lush grasslands. I like the idea of a flaming you will find rabbit. And Pokemon working together, and many other locations filled with rich personality. Oh my god, I love this. Pokemon battles are the most popular form of entertainment in the Gala region. You mean like in every other Pokemon region? Stadiums across the Gala region are frequently aside from that one that where fashion was a thing. Between gym leaders and challengers. Okay. Oh, the now it's like a big thing. Often All right. Broadcast on television in the Gala region as well. Okay. 
The most exciting part of visiting a new region is, of course, encountering Pokemon that you've never seen before. And the culture, as well. To tell you more about some of the Pokemon that reside in the Galar region, I'd like to hand it over to James, the art director on these games. Who's been drawing a Pikachu on the, on the board the entire time. I like the sheep one. Hello. I'm James Turner from Game Freak. Hi, James Turner from I Game Freak. I'm the art director for these games. There are a lot nice. of never-before-seen Pokemon that await you in the Gala region. But and I want one of them as my starter. Just a few of them. Actually, I want two of them as my starter. The first Pokemon. Would I'd not like mind a third. Is I want you. That's this not Pokemon's one of the two. Defining characteristic is its fluffy fur, which is treasured by oh weavers in a town in the Gala region. Oh my god. Popular specialty goods. Gala this region. Pokemon okay. Is Subtitles is weird. The flowering Pokemon. Gossifleur. Gossifleur favors places with clean air and water. And nice. its pollen is said to have healing properties. Oh! This next Pokemon is called Dreadnor. Dreadnor. Ooh. The sharp want you. edges of its jaw. Not really because you look awesome, but like you look like you could do something. Iron. Its vicious nature makes it a difficult Pokemon to tame for all but the most experienced trainers. That too. That's another this reason Pokemon I want him. That can be seen flying steadily. Oh my god, is that a Reaper bird? Corviknight. Corviknight. Nice. It puts its skills to use when Edgy. A flying taxi. Which will take I'm catching you and nicknaming you Edgebird. He or she has previously visited. Ooh, nice. As many of you already know, some Pokemon can evolve, changing no their shit and becoming stronger in the process. You're really bringing that point up in like is one 2019 when Pokemon's when been out for 20 plus years. Oh my god. Okay, that's that's pretty. Eldegoss. That's pretty. As you can see, that is a big cotton ball, seeds though. Scattered across its fuzzy head. Mm-hmm. It's also got a big ass cotton ball. In plants Not cotton ball. Uh, both people what is it? and Pokemon. Dandelion. Sorry. That's dandelion. I can show you this time. It's big dandelion puff ball. Pokemon living in the Gala region for you to discover. Mm hmm Of course, you can look forward to finding many Pokemon you're already familiar with. I don't know that one. I didn't know the one before that. I knew Growlithe, though. Encounter the amazing variety I'm an old man. Pokemon that inhabit the I've region. only played up to Gen 2. And maybe a couple other ones outside of that. I played Pokemon Black. And a bit of... Meeting lots of Pokemon some of the newer the ones of the that I couldn't finish because my 3DS is still bricked. And where you will find the widest variety don't of tell Pokemon Nintendo. out of anywhere in the galaxy. Nintendo's gonna find out anyway. a place called the Wild Area. Okay, cool. What does this that mean? This wild area stretches between cities and is filled with abundant nature as far as the eye can see. Oh. Different Pokemon can appear depending on where you are and what the weather is like, meaning there Ooh. will be new discoveries for you each day. Some of you may already have noticed, but while adventuring through this area, you have control over the camera, allowing you to better search oh. for Search far and wide in the tall grass, in the skies above, and even in the lakes. So you're telling you me this is free roam <laughs> between cities? In certain locations in the gallery. region, oh my a God. phenomenon can be triggered that makes a Pokemon giant in size oh and gives it incredible God. strength. This phenomenon is called Dynamaxing. Dynamaxing opens up new possibilities in the oh my God. performed by trainers and their Pokemon. Oh my God. For details, I would like to turn it over to Iwao, the planning director for the games. How do you spell his name? The subtitles didn't do it right, I'll tell you that much. Hi, I'm Iwao, Hello, Iwao. I'm Game Freak, and the planning Iwao -san. for Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Let me tell you more about the new Dynamax feature, which will I'm assuming it's first name, last name, because... Battles. ...localization. Pokemon Ooh. from the Gala region can Dynamax to not only become massive in size, but also boost their power. Well, I kind of figured. Let me guess, all this is going to be banned in all tournaments. Powerful maximums. This is going to be banned in all Dynamax Pokemon tournaments, I'm sure. However, oh. the Pokemon will revert to normal after three turns. 
Okay. So, you need to choose wisely when to trigger it. So maybe it's not an Mastering issue. Mastering Dynamax will be key to becoming a full-fledged Pokemon trainer in these games. Okay. Remember that wild area we told you about? Yeah. If you connect to other players, you'll find more ways to play there. Connect to other players? One of these new multiplayer features is... Oh my god, it's multiplayer! <laughs> ...in which four Pokemon trainers can join forces to challenge wild Dynamax Pokemon. Oh my god, it's multiplayer. And there's raids! In Max Raid Battles, the wild Dynamax Pokemon keeps its giant form for the entire battle. Ooh. Not only that, it also has special powers that make it an extremely formidable opponent. Oh, only one of these yeah. four players who have teamed up for the Max Raid Battle will be able to Dynamax their Pokemon in each battle. So coordinating with your team will be crucial when taking on these powerful wild Pokemon. Hell yes! I want this! If you this. and your allies manage to emerge victorious, you will get a chance to capture the Pokemon in a truly dynamic catch sequence. I can't believe you said that. The Pokemon that you can take on in Max Raid Battles also vary depending on where you are in the wild area and the state of the weather. Okay. Among these different Pokemon are some that can only be caught after you defeat them in Max Raid Battles. So we mm. hope trainers will join forces and test their skills against a variety of Pokemon. Question is, who catches the Pokemon afterwards? Max Raid Battles feature strategic cooperation. Because if it's everybody, then cool. If it's just Pokemon, the one person the who could Dynamax in the first place, that's not really cool. It's going to be a ton of fun to use your Nintendo Switch system's local wireless phone. And I'm sure there's to going to be some kind of a in person Wait, local? experience the excitement to get. Local! You can also connect with other players over the internet to okay, enjoy good. playing with other trainers from all around the world. Okay, phone. good. It's like if you so have I if you're seriously only doing local, that's a problem. At least in this day and age. Okay, I gotta pee soon. How much longer? Oh, okay, we're almost done. Next, I would like to introduce some of the people you'll encounter on your adventure. Okay. This guy is the greatest trainer in the Galar region, and is also he? the current champion. His name is Leon. Okay. In a region where Hello, Pokemon Leon. You're missing so part of your beard enjoyed. there. His undefeated Sand. record in official matches. There's a little bit of beard here, incredible. missing. And you his got like is only no upper beard. By his shining personality, I guess that's fine. Winning him the adoration of trainers across the region. It's no exaggeration to say that he is the most prominent trainer in his all. His aren't really that small. The champion has a younger brother who also happens to be one of your rivals. Okay. His name is Hop. Hop. Hop dreams to one day become champion just like Hop? his elder brother, and he trains vigorously every day towards this goal. All right. I can't wait to crush his, his dreams on that regard. Region begins on the same day as yours. Oh, nice. On your journey, you and Hop will receive a great deal of support from these two characters. Okay. Professor Magnolia is the professor of the Galar region and nice. specializes in researching the Dynamax phenomenon. Sonia is her granddaughter and also serves as her assistant. Their abundant <laughs> wisdom and sound advice will surely come in handy throughout your adventure. Alrighty then. Cannot wait to meet them. So, is, so the motif for these is actually Next, international like football Pokemon, or American the soccer. You and international your football. Will need to take on the Pokemon gyms I should probably just start calling it football. Achieve your goal of it's, uh, it's football everywhere else. It's just soccer in the these states, and I don't agree with that. In very American that football is poor man's rugby. <laughs> anyway. The gym leaders also have extremely powerful Dynamax Pokemon on their teams, so All you right. need to counter them with some of your own. Can do. I'm sure there will be a way to not two Dynamax need Pokemon to Dynamax against the Dynamax Pokemon, the so... To reach its peak. Maybe that'll uh, be a kind of Nuzlocke fight thing. Let me introduce one of the gym leaders to you. You can't actually this Dynamax anybody. Expert, Milo. Milo, you look... This gym leader Your face is, all is about adorable. Battles alongside his trustworthy Pokemon. Your face you is adorable, sir. His tenacious fighting style to continue your journey. All right. It looks like you don't have a nose, but I see the I see the nose on your model. The course of your adventure. There's no we nose shading. Quite a bit today. But Does he have a nose? Have is he supposed to? I would like you to see. Okay. Please take a look. 
I'm going to take a look and hold my pee a little further, a little longer. Not actual game footage. Okay. Kind of figured because it doesn't look that. It doesn't look as an as a uh, awesome. The game doesn't look as awesome. Hello. Oh. That's a sword. That's a shield. Oh. Oh, I see now. That's the that's the motif I I see him doing. Okay. What? So one legendary is the sword, one's the shield, and that's how that works. They look almost identical though. So the two Pokemon you saw in the video just now are in fact legendary Pokemon of the Gala region. No shit. Zashian and Zamazenta. Zashian and Zamazenta, okay. But yeah, no shit. Look forward to discovering for yourself just what role Zashian and Zamazenta will play in the story. Probably a world-ending crisis, like the last few. I hope you enjoy oh, no. today's Pokemon Direct. Of course. But yeah, that's kind of how that works. Today is just a small part of what in you will past. find in Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. All right. There are many more Pokemon and interesting characters for you to discover in the Galar region. I'm hyped. We're putting everything we've got here at Game Freak into making Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield a game that everyone around the world will enjoy. It sounds it. I'm hyped for this. I want this. Please look forward to it. Okay. Bye. Why, why this? Thanks to all of our guests from Game Freak. Finally, I would like to announce the release date. Pokemon and? Sword. November. Pokemon okay, Shield. good. Will be available okay, good. November 15, I have a lot of time to save money for that. <laughs> as a global simultaneous release. Nice. Starting today, you can pre-order a special double pack. Stay tuned for more information. Why though? I hope you will look forward to your new Pokemon adventure in the Galar region. Here's the thing though. Thank you. In for each watching. game, there's going to be region. There's going to be game specific, like Pokemon and whatnot. Why not, hear me out, why not just offer one game or the other and then offer a DLC thing for like half the game's full price that unlocks all the regional thing, that, not region, that unlocks all the other game's Pokemon in the same areas. Does it, e does it even matter? Like, I guess the double pack would be useful if you have someone who wants one game and then another person in your family who wants the other one, but... I live alone, dude. I don't have anyone else to play Pokemon with other than friends online, so I guess it doesn't matter. I don't know which version I'll be getting. Probably Sword, though, because the Sword... the Sword Dog. Sword Dog is good dog, and I'm gonna nickname him Dee Dee. Because Diamond Dogs. Diamond Dogs Dog. Anyway, that is Pokemon Direct! 6 5 2019. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you to Shro and Love for supporting me on Patreon. And leave a comment below if you are also hyped. I'm hyped. Are you hyped? I hope you are, because I'm going to be getting sword and probably raiding with people. I got to pee real bad. So I'm going to end this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.